So what are you going to teach me today, Michelle? The importance of good <laughs> hand washing. Hand washing? Yes. Okay. I noticed outside that uh -huh. you accidentally sneezed. Maybe. No, you did. I did. I, you did. I did sneeze. Men do everything with your hands. We tried. No, you go to the bathroom, you eat. No, no, I, okay, all right. Let's be fair. Yes. And you went, choo! Okay. So, now we have potty germs, we have eating germs, and we have nostril germs. Ooh, that's not so good. No, because now, good. anything you touch, like your glasses to yeah. your face, yeah, it's going to get on. Okay, my hands. Yeah. Okay, hands. all right, so... What are we doing? We're gonna wash hands. We're gonna wash our hands. I love it. Okay, all right, I let's love do it. it. Let's do it. Yes, let's do my it. children. Okay. So making sure that everything in your bathroom is always convenient. Okay. Soap, some kind of hand sanitizer, paper towels. You always turn on your water first. Temperature, Got it. you're Got good. It. You push twice. Okay. You start your friction. Friction? Yes. Got now it. I am so old, they saw, taught me how to sing songs okay. while I'm washing in between my fingers. So what are we doing? We're singing happy birthday. Happy birthday? Yes, happy birthday. You sing that three times. You okay. sing happy birthday three times while you're washing your hands? Yes. That's Every gonna take a long time. No. No, 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 no. And then you rinse, and you want to rinse in a downward motion. Okay. You're not a surgeon. Okay. You don't have to go all the way to the elbows, but okay. you are, are cleaning and getting rid of everything that you did to yourself, through yourself, and while you were eating. People often forget that. After you eat, after you use the restroom, after you sneeze, people think if they sneeze in their arm, mm -hmm. it's okay. It's their sleep. Now, um, I noticed that you're kind of rinsing your hands and washing your hands for a pretty long time. Is that kind of what we should be doing, or? No, it wasn't long. That Three wasn't courses. long? Three courses of happy birthday. Three courses of happy, all right, let me try it. Let me try it. Let me try it. And we're we also go. drying between our fingers. Now, should I get my hands wet first or is this I, okay? I do a little bit. Okay, here we go. Um, now what I do, I try to, is I try to make sure that I get that, you know, kind of in between the finger thing going. Um, like you said, I don't think this is a surgical scrub because if it was a surgical scrub, we would actually have to use a special tool to remove everything from underneath your fingernails, but hopefully there shouldn't be too much underneath the fingernails after a sneeze. I hope not. I hope not I hope either. Not. <laughs> we never know. Okay. I'm going to add a little extra water, see if I can get those suds going. Keep it going here. And if you can't sing in your head, you can hum. No, if you have a great. favorite song. <laughs> Is that long enough? Maybe? No? One more version. One more version? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Michelle. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to, to me. You. Okay, so that was the third time. Now let's go for the rinse. Make sure in a downward motion. Downward. Everything's going down the sink, down the drain. Towards the drain. Perfect. Good. Now, how do I know when I'm done rinsing? I mean, I kind of feel like all the suds are gone now. If Is you that... can't feel any debris and your hands feel cleaner, yeah. then I would think say you have a good clean. Or, I mean, would it be good to maybe go for like 10 seconds or, I don't know, just... 20, 20 to 30 with wow. a knife. Okay. okay. Especially healthcare workers with as much uh, yes. Yes. as we come in contact with. That's true. He uses his elbow, but now he's contaminated his clothing. What? I saved 
I saved this. I'm a freak. So I could push and then dispose. Okay. Each person has their own way. No, I think I like that technique because Each you're basically person. just keeping everything as clean as possible. I think that's probably a good way to go. And ladies, I encourage you, the next time you go into Macy's, JCPenney, Sears, one of your nicer department stores, Nordstrom's, go to the restroom, stand, sit, whatever, over in the corner. Watch how many people go in, how many ladies go in there and do not ever wash their hands and open the door. You will save your paper towels. You will keep <laughs> some in your, your pocketbook. Yeah. I hope somebody will remember to wash their hands. <laughs> so the paper towel handle grab. Right. Paper towel closure to keep things as clean as possible. Right. All right. So and just today's, stay safe. Yeah. Today's teaching point is when your hands are dirty, wash them and follow Michelle's instructions. She knows what she's talking about. Y'all have a nice day.